uh, that started years ago where the artists actually just come and they have a space on the street that's already marked off for um, artists to come and draw. They pave it specially and there's a, um, it's marked off. They put a metal mark around it and the artists are free to come anytime they want and draw on the street. And the tradition is that they put out a little tin and the passers-by or tourists or whatever put money in the tin as a donation to the artist. Traditionally, they do um, classical renditions of um, either what's in the Sistine Chapel or famous paintings or Michelangelo's work, Raphael's work, a lot of images of Christ, that kind of stuff. Um, so it's, it's a real, real um, Italian tradition. We started at 8 a.m. and it was a blank space, just black. And we went ahead and drew it in first. We, we did the grid. We drew what was in each square. Particular square, drew all that. And then, then added color. It's just a giant coloring book, that's what it is. Well, we used an ancient method of, uh, of grid. We would we'd grid off our drawing, uh, one to one scale. In other words, one inch equals one foot. And then we enlarged that grid onto the floor, and we, we just chalked it out. We used chalk and basic measuring tools to do the entire process. We're associated with the parade. There are some festivals that are strictly chalk art festivals, and there's a, a committee of people similar to what we have that work on, often it's in the streets, they work on getting the streets closed, getting vendors to come to provide food and entertainment. We thought about it and said, well, we've already got streets closed, and we've already got vendors and food and entertainment. We can just add the chalk art to the event we've already established. It's, a, it's an Alphonse Mucha. It's actually a, a la an advertisement for a cigarette company of that time. I traded it for a I love this. I guess that's all I, could, I can say. I, it's great. It's a great, great thing to do this with a, with a team. Because I didn't have the help that I was supposed to have, um, and I was by myself, um, my neighbors and a, a passerby decided to help me fill in my background for me. So they just pitched in, and you know, that's a true fact that uh, there are good people out there in a way. <laughs> well, it's, it's, it's just like life, you know, we're here temporarily, so. You know, just make it bright, I guess. Just, just live it. <laughs> Just live your life. You know?